Andy from HEL. I'm here to tell you all about our new product, Polyblock Plate. This is a product that's particularly close to my own heart. Before I moved into sales, I was a high throughput chemist and spent a lot of time doing chemical synthesis in microtiter plates. Now this isn't always straightforward, and a lot of the problems come down to effective mixing within a microtiter plate. Now classically there are a couple of solutions to this. The one most commonly used is vortexing, where you swirl the plate round. Now this works well if you've got a small amount of liquid in the bottom and you just slosh it round, you will get mixing. However, as soon as you've got a reasonable amount of liquid in the well, it's just too full. As you mix it, it will either fly out the top or it will just move back and forth and you'll have no mixing. The other solution that's commonly used is magnetic tumble stirring. This requires huge magnetic fields to throw magnetic stir sticks back and forth against the sides of each well. It gives good mixing, but you have huge magnetic fields involved. This interferes with other laboratory equipment, is dangerous to people with pacemakers, and can even wipe the credit card in your pocket. HEL Polyblock Plate is an excellent addition to any laboratory where you're doing plate-based work. This could be a reaction screen, a catalyst screen, or a small array synthesis. Underneath each individual zone here are a number of magnetic stirrers. These have been precision positioned in order to give even magnetic stirring across a complete plate. So you get stirring in every single well of the plate. Each zone has a different stir speed that you can set and a different temperature you can set. Maximum temperature is up to 190 degrees C, although we often cap that in the software because people are using plastic plates and you don't want to melt them. Like all HEL systems, Polyblock Plate is controlled by a powerful WinISO software. This allows you to write recipes and plans to run the system unattended. All the data is logged and captured and is also displayed in a live graph. Today we're going to give two examples of stirring on the polyblock plate. First is this 48 position rack. This is from HPLC vials and we've got a set of vials here all glued together just to make it a bit easier. In each of those is some stand and a magnetic stirring flea. And we're just going to go through and put them in each of the six positions of there, show just how quickly this kicks up and mixes the sand. The second is a classic 96 well plate where we've put some magnetic stirring fleas, and we're just going to do a close up where we can see them all moving together. So, firstly, we put these in in the top position. You can see it going from a clear position, it's immediately cloudy as the sand is straight away kicked up. We then move it across the block. You can see it keeps on stirring across each of the six positions. That's the third, fourth, fifth, and sixth. And secondly, we can see this 96 well plate with every position stirring effectively. So there we have it, our HEL polyblock plate system. An ideal addition to any laboratory where you're doing work in plates. Would that be screening of catalysts or reactions or small array synthesis? Polyblock plate provides effective magnetic stirring across the complete plate as well as heating and it's all under a computer control so you've got full data capture and you can leave it running unattended. For more information visit our website www.helgroup.com or email us at the address at the end of the video.